everyone. Welcome to this edition of Hold It! A monthly look at a brand spanking new adult nonfiction book recently added to the library's collection. Each month, we'll give you a quick synopsis of the book while flashing the title and the book's call number at the bottom of the screen. Now, if you like what you hear, simply Hold It! by going to the My Account tab on the library website. Enter your entire library card number as your user ID and your PIN, which is the last four digits of that same library card number. Then enter the title or the call number and hold it. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. We'll email you or give you a call when your hold is available. Now let's get to this month. Hold it! Now if you're a fan of CBS Television's Cradle Minds or the Netflix series Mindhunters, then this month's featured book is definitely for you. Shadow Man is the latest work of author Ron Franchel, who chronicles with thorough research the early days of the FBI's Behavioral Science Unit. Franchel zeroes in on the work of four individual agents, Howard Tetton, Patrick Mullaney, and Robert Ressler from the FBI's Quantico headquarters, and Montana-based Special Agent Pete Dunbar. The application of abnormal psychology to criminal investigation was largely an academic exercise and highly suspect during the J. Edgar Hoover FBI years. That all changed with the abduction and murder of two seemingly unrelated female victims in the bucolic town of Manhattan, Montana in 1973. When standard investigation techniques failed to turn up any leads or evidence, Dunbar reached out to Tetton and Mullaney, and while their initial uh, collaboration was tenuous at best, this very first use of criminal profiling ultimately led to the arrest of serial killer David Meyerhofer, a 23-year-old Vietnam veteran and lifelong resident of Manhattan. Suspected initially of the crimes, Meyerhofer had passed a lie detector test, and the administration of truth serum. Yet, beneath the facade of seeming normalcy, Meyerhofer proved to be a callous psychopath who lied easily and was capable of unspeakable depravity. Shadow Man, part history and part true crime is an exceptional work and one we can highly recommend. Well, that's this month's Hold it. selection. You can find this book plus many other new and best-selling titles in our new nonfiction display. And we've also gathered some of nonfiction's greatest hits for you in our nonfiction recommendations display shelf. Enjoy, and see you next time for Hold It!